Hi everyone, if you're new to my channel, this is me, Diana, and welcome to Diana Vlogs. But before anything else, please make sure to click that subscribe button and the bell beside it para lagi kang notified pag may mga bago tayong uploads. So for today's video, I have here other products from G21 brand. Another, because if you haven't watched my G21 matte lip tint review yet, you can freely check it out on my YouTube channel. So here I got the G21 powder lip ink and the cookie brows. For both 180 pesos each. And sha. Let's start with the packaging. To be honest with you guys, nag expect ako ng a little too much sa kanya. Kasi as you can see sa picture, or if hindi pa, ilalagay ko na lang dito. Or somewhere yung picture. So you guys can see. Medyo matingkad yung color niya sa picture and na enhance to make it look more appealing or attractive siguro. So the lip tint comes from this little box that says G21 Powder Lip Ink that it has 15 ml worth of product in each container, the shade indicator, the logo, and at the back you can clearly see the how to apply or the directions on how to use. Bukod doon, wala nang ibang nakalagay. And nandito rin pala yung kanyang ingredients. Grape seed oil, a vitamin E, iron oxide, fragrance SPF 15, and natural preservative. Yun lang, wala nang nakalagay. Hindi nakalagay kung kailan siya na manufacture, kung saan siya galing, and kung kailan siya mag expire there's a total of four shades na meron sila. The Peony, the Blossoms, the Windflower, and Rosum ata yung isa. Pero itong dalawa yung nasa akin, yung Peony and Blossom. Magaganda silang lahat pero ito yung pinakagusto ko. So ayan, let's try to open the box to see what's inside. Ayan siya. Alis lang. Reminds me of the Peripera from Korea, if you know that. Pero ito, dinikit lang yung kanyang name. Shade Indicator. And yun, medyo natatanggal na siya. Yan, kung nakikita niya. Open din natin yung isa. Si Blossom. Ang cute. Magkaiba sila ng takip. Yung isa is black. Itong blossom is pink. So, let's try to open the product itself. Ayan siya. nag expect ako ng a little dropper sa kanya or kagaya ng mga serum. But it comes with a dual shot applicator. Ayan siya. Na may maliit na hole sa gitna. Yung amoy niya, para lang siyang bubblegum, pagaya lang din ng G21 Matte Lip Tint na binigyan ko ng review. Swatch natin yung kanyang shade color. So, ayan si shade. Um, Yoni. Blend it out. Yan, ganda ng color niya. Try natin si Shane Blossom. I don't know guys if you can see. Ayan siya. My counting stopper sa kanya when you try pulling its applicator which is maganda para kaunting product or sakto lang yung mailabas niya so let's move on with their cookie brow super matte eyebrow pomade yan siya nakalagay siya sa isang maliit na maliit na can which is super cute ayan and dinikit lang itong kanyang parang uh, sticker 
cookie sticker. And sa likod niya, nakalagay yung kanyang name. Super Matte Eyebrows Pomade in the shade Pretzel. That it has 10 ml worth of product. Yan. And it comes with this spoolie. And an angled brush. Which is good kasi wala ako ni isang ganito and wala akong maaring magamit kapag ito ang i-apply ko sa aking eyebrows. So let's try to put everything on my lips and brows to finally find out how it works. So let's follow the direction on how to apply. Shake the bottle well. Apply two to three dots. Blend using your fingers. Let it dry. Yeah. Shake well. Apply two to three dots, okay? And blend it all over your lips using fingers. And that long box. But I forgot to tell you guys, hindi ako naglagay ng kahit ano sa lips ko. Cool. Let's add another dot. I will pull you guys in closer so that you can see.
guys, I'm back with my final verdict about this product. Unahin natin itong si Lip Ink. Ayan. I was expecting it to be more watery kasi nga lip ink siya. Pero hindi pala siya ganun ka-watery. Ka Ayan. Very lightweight din siya sa lips. Hindi mo akalain o hindi mo mafe-feel that you have something on your lips. And super ganda ng shade niya. Okay na okay siya for everyday fresh look. Ayan, hindi ako nahirapan sa kanya since the applicator is too short and hindi siya ganun kahaba. And another good thing about it is that nung in-apply ko siya, uh, ginamit ko yung kanilang 3 dots rule. And okay na okay na yung shade sa akin because a little product naman will give you that satisfying satisfying shade. Kaya kahit konti o madami yung ilagay mo, okay lang siya. As nakita nyo naman kanina sa video, ba? Pinakita ko sa inyo yung three dots and the another layers. Ayan. Actually, itong gamit ko, six dots lang yan. And I blended out using my fingers. Okay na okay. Hindi rin siya drying and sticky sa feels, which is much better. Mas nagustuhan ko siya kaysa sa G21 Matte Water Stain na binigyan ko rin ng review. Although, mas mura yun kasi 120 pesos lang siya. And this is 180 pesos. But considering na super ganda niya, and hindi siya ganun kamat, the price 180 is justifiable. So, dito naman tayo sa kanilang cookie brows. Maganda siya. Okay naman siya sa pigment. Laban siya. Pero medyo nahirapan ako to apply using their angled brush kasi medyo malambot or maybe it's just about me na hindi naman ang ganun kahilig or marunong gumamit nito. Maybe it's just me. Mas mahilig kasi ako sa stick. And it's my first time using this angled brush and spoolie. And when I try to blend it out using their spoolie, some of the products were dragged away. Ayan o. Which is good for me kasi minsan napapasobra ako. Uh, okay yun kasi nabiblend talaga siya. Nabiblend out siya evenly. And one thing is that sana may darker shades pa sila for like darker roots like me. Kasi medyo dark yung hair ko and medyo malight si pretzel for me. Ewan ko lang pero mukhang okay naman. Talking about the price, 180 Ayan siya. To be honest, if it's the product alone, medyo pricey talaga siya for me. But considering that it comes with this angled brush and spoolie, okay na rin yung 180. So, that's it for today's video, guys. I hope nakatulong ako if you're interested about these products. And I hope you love it. And if you guys want more of this kind of videos, please let me know by just putting your comments below. And thank you again, guys, for watching. Bye!